Hey all, welcome to Infobook Technologies YouTube channel. Today we're going to see Android library. So what is Android library? Android library is a structurally the same as an Android app module, which includes source file, resource file, and Android manifest and Gradle, etc. However, instead of compiling into an APK that runs on a device, the Android library compiles into AAR file, which is an Android Archive file that you can use as a dependency for an Android application module. So what is the use of Android library project? When you're building multiple applications that uses some of the same components, such as like uh, activity service or ULAO, so in that case, you can use it, like simply add the library as a dependency into your code. So different ways, you can access the libraries. The one is create a library module and keep it in your project. So that way you can access easily. And uh, the other way is create a library module and publish into a global in order to access remotely or share the library among other projects. So what are the possible ways? Publishing to the library project. One is Maven Publish and Jetpack IO and jfro so we'll see one by one so before that we'll see how to create a library project in android studio let's get into android studio here i have created my sample library here we are going to create a library module so right click on uh, the application and go for module so it will prompt you what you want select and uh, click on Android library and go for next and uh, you can name anything as you like I would like to say math application and finished so if you see the bottom the math operation library project is created so here I'm going to create a one class file. I'll go to Kotlin. Just a file. And that's a math tutors. Create a method. Perform add. As a uh, integers, int b is int. So make this method as a return type as b, yes. and uh, it will return a plus b. Yes. So, so successfully we have created a library project which contains a method called perform add and it will return the A plus B. So before that, we have to add this math operation library project into the application. So if you get into below, you will see a settings dot create up, double click it, and you will see the include math operation. Doesn't mean that the project is included into the application. This math uh, library project into this application, we have to add our implementation into the Gradle file. So if you see, you don't see any Gradle implementation. So in order to implement that, right click the application, go to open module settings and uh, uh, click on dependencies, click on app and go for the plus icon and a module dependency and it will find the math operation so select this and say okay and apply legit build so if you see here the math operation library project is added so similarly if it is a remote if it is published so you will add as like kind of com dot math operations like version name 1.2.2 something else let's see one by one 
So this is successfully added. So now I'm going to show you how this is executed. So the same way I'm going to create a Kotlin file. Let's say crash access math results. And uh, print perform add. So I'm going to pass two command three. So four. Uh, let's run this. See, the answer is six. So we performed the add operation. So if you see the structure, app creator the access math util Kotlin class into the app uh, application and uh, the math utils it's in the math operation our library project next we're going to see how to access from the remote